a Wikivide Documentaries production. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Enjoy. Chris Cuomo Christopher Charles Cuomo is an American television journalist who currently works at CNN, where he presents Cuomo Prime Time, a regular weeknight CNN show. Cuomo has previously been the ABC News chief law and justice correspondent on the co-anchor for ABC's 2020. And before his current show, he was one of two co-anchors of the weekday edition of New Day, a three-hour morning news show, until May 24, 2018. Early Life and Education Cuomo was born in the New York City borough of Queens. He is the son of Matilda and Mario Cuomo, the former governor of New York, and the brother of Andrew Cuomo, the current governor of New York. He was educated at the Albany Academy, a private university preparatory day school in Albany, New York, followed by Yale University, where he obtained an undergraduate degree, and Fordham University where he obtained his Juris Doctor. He is a licensed attorney. Career Cuomo's early career in journalism included appearances related to social and political issues on CNBC, MSNBC, and CNN. He was a correspondent for Fox News and Fox Broadcast Network's Fox Files, where he covered a wide range of stories focusing on controversial social issues. He also served as a political policy analyst for Fox News at ABC and as co-anchor of 2020. His coverage included a look at heroin addiction. His year-long coverage revealed the heroin addiction affecting suburban families. His other work has included coverage of the Haiti earthquake, child custody, bullying, and homeless teens. Policy change has come after his undercover look at for-profit school recruiters, leading to an industry cleanup and Cuomo's tip from a BMW owner led to a recall of over 150,000 affected models. From September 2006 to December 2009, he was the news anchor for Good Morning America. He was the primary reporter on breaking news stories, both in the US and around the world, including dozens of assignments in some 10 countries. He covered the war on terrorism, embedded on multiple occasions in Pakistan. Afghanistan, and Iraq. In the U.S. he covered shootings such as Virginia Tech, Fort Hood, and the Pennsylvania Amish school shootings, Hurricanes Katrina and Rita, the Sago mine collapse, and the Minneapolis Bridge collapse in August 2007. He anchored morning and evening coverage. He maintains a website, Cuomo on the case, where he takes questions, and which acts as a platform for his reporting and discussion on a number of issues. He had two weekly digital programs on ABC News, The Real Deal and Focus on Faith, that discussed matters of spirituality. He also appeared with Father Edward Beck on ABC News Now, the network's 24-hour digital outlet. In February 2013, Cuomo moved to CNN to co-host its morning show. He made his debut on CNN as field anchor on the February 8, 2013, episode of Piers Morgan Tonight, covering the February 2013 Nor'easter. While serving as the co-anchor of CNN's morning show New Day, it was announced that Cuomo would move to primetime to host Cuomo Primetime. In October 2017, sister network HLN premiered a new documentary series hosted by the anchor, Inside with Chris Cuomo, which focuses on stories affecting real people in real towns and cities across America. In September 2018, he began hosting a two-hour weekday radio show, Let's Get After It on the POT US channel on Sirius XM. Controversies In 2015 Cuomo claimed on Twitter that, hate speech, is unprotected by the First Amendment, which led to some media reports stating that he was in error. He later clarified that he was referring, correctly, to hate speech that falls under unprotected categories, citing the 1941 Supreme Court case Chaplinsky v. New Hampshire, which excluded, fighting words, from the First Amendment protection. In 2016, he conducted what Bo Gardner and Parthios said appeared to be atheism checks on political candidates when he was the moderator of several CNN presidential election, town halls, a pattern that Gardner criticized. In a 2016 CNN segment about the political fallout surrounding Hillary Clinton and the ongoing leaks of the Podesta emails, Cuomo said, also interesting is, remember, 
It's illegal to possess these stolen documents. It's different for the media. So everything you're learning about this, you're learning from us. Some legal experts contested his assertions. Brought to you by Wikividi Documentaries. Would you like to know more?